Hello, Just Too Good here. I was excited for an advertised live stream at 12 p.m. on Tuesday, October 22nd. This live stream would reveal a new Lego set. So I figured surely this would be a set that's different from the Botanical Garden as it was revealed three hours earlier before the live stream. But guess what? It turned out to just be the Botanical Garden set. Really? Why advertise this as a new set reveal? It's not a reveal if it was revealed three hours before, officially, with an embargo date and everything. Now this live stream just further advertised the set. At least we got a close-up of the set, though I thought the RLFM people did that really well with the footage from the recent RLFM days in Denmark, which included this set. At the very least, they showed the giveaway promo at the beginning of this live stream. But that was revealed at 10 a.m. earlier today on LEGO.com. So again, no new reveals here. LEGO needs to get better at these live events. I mean, just do like a Nintendo Direct where you just feed a set after set that hasn't been revealed. Make sure some stuff that doesn't get leaked hasn't been revealed. But I mean, they're so bad with handling leaks. I'm not surprised that they've never really done this. If you remember, they tried to do this at LEGOCon, which was this live stream event for two years. How did you play drive through Should I get the chicken sandwich? Dude, chicken sandwich, honestly. I like getting the chicken sandwich. If you want the, if they made it, they should make a just too good Chick-fil-A meal because I have a specific Chick-fil-A chicken sandwich, no pickles. You add American cheese on that bit and then you put mayo on that bit. And then they had to cancel the event because it got such bad reception, it seemed like because they would do the same thing where they would just show us stuff that we've seen before, show us content that a lot of people in the chat were just ending up asking, hey, show us a set, show us a set, show us a set. And then would reveal one new set out of a sea of sets we've already revealed, advertising them as reveals, even though they're sets that we've seen. I don't know. I just thought this whole live stream event was kind of a big fail. I mean, these designers are cool people, don't get me wrong. And it's not their fault that LEGO falsely advertised this as a new set reveal. But come on, LEGO. I was out and I put this on my schedule. Hey, I gotta go to this live stream event because it seems like something super exciting. And it just turned out to be something that was revealed three hours earlier that we have footage from RLFM people of. Speaking of the Botanical Gardens expansion set, again, this will be available from the 1st of November to I believe the 7th of November if you're a VIP member. And I do like this as an addition to the Botanical Garden set. But if you want my full thoughts on the Botanical Garden set, I already did another video for that earlier today. I'll see you later. Let me know in the comments if I'm being too harsh here. Peace out. Bye.